happy monday everyone welcome to the vlog it is 7 56 and i am about to start work i have our new podcast episode queued up so i can listen through it and just make sure everything sounds good but i'm really excited about this week's episode you guys should go listen if you haven't already it's an episode where we just talked about things our parents did when we were growing up that we really appreciate now whether it be things that we didn't like, that we liked, um, but just things that have kind of stuck with us. And it was just so fun to like reflect on and talk about. So gonna listen to that this morning. Um, I'm excited because I got a little matcha bowl. I had previously been using this one that I just, let me get it. I got from Suzanne and it's really cute and it's definitely not meant to be a matcha bowl but it's just like a good size but I wanted one that has a little pour spout so when I pour the matcha out um, it like pours nicely so I'm really excited and it came with a matching matcha whisk holder so so cute I'm gonna use that this morning and we are gonna start the day off right with a matcha latte and then we're gonna go to work happy tuesday i am about to head to a coffee shop honestly it's kind of becoming routine at this point um but i'm going to a new place and it's called armistice i believe and it's in i think there's three locations i'm going to the roosevelt one i'm gonna go meet mari and i'm just gonna camp out there for the rest of the work day but i just wanted to say hello show you quickly my cozy coffee shop outfit i've literally been wearing these pants for the past three days like every day because I don't know why like I feel like I'm just going through a phase with them a little bit and they're just the best so this is the fit I have on this knit quarter zip from Everlane I got this color last season but they come out with this sweater every year it seems like and they always have such cute colors so there's a lot of cute ones right now so definitely check that out I have on that Ghani World tee underneath I kind of like how it's like peeking through a little bit and then the bottom of the shirt has like this pink stitching so I think it's cute like poking out and then I'm just wearing these gray Jerf Avenue trousers and my little New Balance sneakers because we are staying comfy and we are staying cozy so i'm gonna go now and i will take you guys along i'm excited and i hope it's cute and i have a, i hope they have like a good work area because i feel like sometimes you go and there's like nowhere to sit and actually work so fingers crossed <laughs> coffee shop seriously you guys feels like we really skip fall and we are just in full-blown winter right now but I'm gonna head home record the podcast this afternoon and then at 45 and then I'm gonna have Chinese class so busy evening but I'm looking forward to all of it hello good evening I am about to head out to dinner and drinks with my sister, my future sister-in-law, and then Luke's brother's wife. I don't know what her like technical relation would be to me, but I'm really excited. I'm excited to just have like a nice little girls night, eat some good food. I feel like it's kind of crazy to me that it's only Wednesday because I feel like this week has really just been quite a week like I don't know I feel like there's just been a lot going on and I just feel like I really need some TLC and some girl time so I'm gonna head out in a little bit I wanted to quickly show you guys this lip gloss that I got in the mail today and I actually got it in another color too I'll have both shades linked below but specifically the one I'm wearing right now I think this is like the rosy color it's number three but this is the Peripera glossy ink glossing lip gloss and this is like i think one of their brand new products i've talked about this brand before i think on here but i love this brand they have just like the best shades they're super affordable they're on amazon um it's a cream brand and their products are just amazing this is not sponsored i just saw they came out with this new gloss and i was like gotta have it i think it's nine dollars on amazon and my favorite part right now or my favorite part is 
this like applicator has like a really big indent first of all this like little doe foot is huge which is great um but this part has like a little dome in it so it holds so much product and just makes it so easy to put on um and the color is beautiful so they have like a, a more nude like nutty shade and a clear one um i think at this point i probably will buy the clear one because the formula is just so nice and it smells so good um so i will be taking this to dinner with me um and i guess while we're at it I don't have to leave quite yet so I guess we could just do like a little impromptu what's in my bag uh, what else do we got in here hand sanitizer necessary I feel like since COVID just like in general I feel like it has become a necessity and now I'm more like hyper aware I guess and like I just always like to have sanit hand sanitizer with me um I have like a few of these they're from Daiso and I just think they're so cute and like I don't know fun to carry around my wallet this is from Ghani I love the inside because it's pink um so it's kind of like a fun pop of color I have some little tissues because you never know little brush because you also never know when you need to brush your hair the lip gloss i just showed you oh i also have this one in here this is the dior lip glow color reviver balm in mahogany which i think i talked about in last vlog also sorry the camera just moved cc's like right in front of or like right behind the camera um a pen the best muji pens yes and then i just have my car keys and i have these two little keychains I have a little chimmy banana milk one and this little cookie one. So that's the exciting what's in my bag. I'm going to put this all back in and I'm going to go. And I think that's it. I'll talk to you guys later. I am wearing this Cezanne cardigan that I'm obsessed with. I think you guys have seen it in pretty much like all of my most recent vlogs. I'm still kind of toying with whether or not I like these little pieces out. I don't know. I feel like it's just kind of fun, but at the same time, I'm like, does it look weird? I don't know. So for now, they're going to stay like this, I guess. But um, yeah, my little Cezanne Cardi, I have a little tank top on and then just my Levi's rib cage straight ankle jeans um, and then I think I'm just gonna wear my New Balance sneakers and my camel coat that is right there my usual routine and it's mostly because i don't like the way coffee makes me feel but i am so tired this morning i don't know why it was just like especially hard to wake up this morning so i'm drinking this coffee and the oat milk is really not looking cute in there anyways i might regret this later and i know i probably will but for the time being it has to be done it's been quite a week um i've been very stressed as you can tell by the state of my skin but we're not letting it get us down i'm actually picking up my wedding dress today for like the after the first round of alterations so i don't know if it's going to need more or if i'm just going to be able to take it home but um very exciting i'm a little nervous just because of some of the changes that we did discuss i like wasn't really expecting when i went there the first time so Fingers crossed, all goes well today. I think Ching and I will probably get dinner after she's coming with me because it is very important to me that she knows how to bustle my dress correctly um, so that we can avoid any bustle breakage. But yeah, so I think we'll probably hang out this evening. And then tomorrow, Luke and I are actually going to Bellingham to do some wedding stuff. And then Sunday, we're going to go to Luke's family's house and make some tortellini. And then I'm gonna get my nails done at a new place. And they do like, they specialize in like designs and stuff, which I don't usually do, but I just had a moment and I was like, I'm feeling fun. So I'm excited for this weekend and excited for everything. 
This is today's lunch. Some honey water chips, some tteokbokki, and some kimchi dumplings. busy day i feel like this weekend turned out to be way busier than i was expecting slash mentally prepared for but that's okay because we are going with the flow um this morning luke and i are gonna go to actually that looks funny <laughs> luke and i are gonna go to his parents house and it's a tradition that we make we hand make tortellini every year to prepare for thanksgiving so we're gonna go do that um i'm getting my nails done i'm going to a new place i want to do like something a little bit more fun than i usually do and this place does really good designs and then i'm gonna go climbing um so hopefully my nails don't get completely wrecked but i'm excited to go climbing just to kind of get some physical activity in on this sunday um, and then hopefully this evening will just be relaxing i still need to do my chinese homework i need to edit the pod um i have a lot to do but we're all, we're gonna get it all done it's okay um and I just wanted to say good morning. I got this sweater in the Aritzia clientele sale. This is the only thing I picked up. And this is something, again, that has been on my wish list. So it's the only thing I allowed myself to buy. And I've been wearing it every single day since I got it because I love it so much. Um, I think it's like some variation of the Peggy sweater. I'll have it linked below. But I like it because it's like more of a quarter zip. And it's like really long. So I got a medium, sorry, my laundry, but I got a medium and it's like very long and kind of oversized, but it also looks really cute, like tucked up. Today I'm wearing it longer and I just have on my little denim skirt and I'm going to wear just sneakers to be comfy, um, but I'm obsessed, you guys. I like don't want to wear anything other than this. Um, and I also got this lipstick, or it's a lip balm actually the other day. I feel like these video, these vlogs have turned into me just showing you like 5 million lip products um, in every video. But hey, you know, it's the little things in life. I'm showing you guys what I love. Um, but this is the Chanel Rouge Coco Balm in Natural Charm. So it's really pretty and just like a really great everyday shade. Like today I don't have, um, I put on like a tiny little bit of concealer but I didn't put anything else on. But this is just like a nice little flush of color, a balm. It doesn't feel like too much. Um, so yeah, going to make some tortellini now and I'll see you guys later. 